A South Bay man says he is tired of waiting. He's now trying to build the park that his neighborhood has been promised for decades. But the city of San Jose is balking, and that's triggered a war of words over dirt. Here's NBC Barry Scott Budman. It's going to take a while, but shovel full by shovel full. Mark Espinoza is determined to build a new park in his hometown of Alviso. What you see here is just an empty field with weeds growing. An empty field sitting on three acres of city-owned land on Grant Boulevard. Empty since the year 2000 and long identified as a place for a park. Espinosa says he's tired of waiting for a place the neighborhood can enjoy. I'm fed up. I mean, enough is enough. I'm sick. I'm tired of being sick and tired. So I'm taking things into my own hands and I want to clean the park up. I want to make it usable. I, I know put some plants, put some grass, some benches so people can come and enjoy a park that was intended for them. So he's leading an effort to clean the area up. But again, this work is unauthorized and constitutes trespassing. San Jose's Parks and Recreation Department, which has jurisdiction over the would-be park, says Espinoza and those working with him are going rogue. And it won't help or fund construction of the park unless it's safe. For example, if rocks from the stripping are kicked up, it can become a tripping hazard and any below grade infrastructure damage can be caused. So that means like water mains or power lines can be disrupted. As to what happens next, well, Mark says he plans to continue to very gradually develop a park here. The city says if that's the case, they plan to issue a warning. In Alviso, Scott Budman, NBC, Bay Area News.